Hello, everybody, and welcome back once more to How to Date a Magical Girl. I'm the Outback Al. I'm Yin and Young. I'm Chibi Noob. I'm Empty Jitters. I'm Jiren Cosplay. And I'm Cozy. And we're in a we're in a tight spot. Uh, I mean, I think she'd be like the heart of the team, but why are you asking us about dating right now? Yeah, because Fun. they're about to nerf this bitch. <laughs> I'm big, uncomfy. Oh, I don't Whoa, think they're. Where is this coming from? She gonna get fridged. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay if you can't answer. I was just curious. That's all. It sure would be a shame if you couldn't answer me and something happened to me <laughs> mysteriously and you never got to give it to me, but you've known me longer than any of the other girls and I just wondered how that affects the way you see me. I know I'm not new and exciting like them. Um, okay. But I hope I have some sort of appeal to you. Okay, I she mean, you're very, You're very sweet. Oh boy. But no... <laughs> This reminds me of a TikTok series called The Dead Wife Trope. No. Uh, Where she's just like, uh, Think of me when you see the birds fly, Christopher. Uh, if I should die, which I won't, but I might. Uh, <laughs> Ikari, you're so important to me. You know me better than anyone else. I can be myself around you, and that's valuable to me. Ah. Valuable. Uh, Monetary. I'm valuable to you. Time to die. <laughs> Thank you, okay? That means a lot to me. Hey, uh... we're nearly at your house. Oh, so we are. I'm just gonna be going, because that was rude. See you tomorrow? Yeah, I you had a so. big day, so make sure you get an early night, okay? Uh... Okay, I will. Uh, oh, good night, okay. <laughs> good night, Akari. We'll definitely see each other tomorrow. I am legitimately gonna be surprised <laughs> if she's here today. <laughs> okay, homeroom. Great. Uh, schedule. Oh, Cafe Shiva tonight. That could be a okay. lie. That could be a lie. Okay, so we don't get Miu today. It means we have it's stuff TV to work on. Tip of the day. We can work on stuff today. People like different kinds of food, so be sure to remember what they really like and dislike. We can't give this girl sweet potatoes. Because... That's all I know. <laughs> we can give her lots of wine. Sushi. Yes. <laughs> we'll get her uh -huh. nice and drunk. Wine, sushi, and pizza. <laughs> oh, I love pizza. You know what they like because they could die tomorrow. Okay. Which I won't, but I might. Right. <laughs> A fairly average day of class passes by. That's but where's Hikari? Oh. Holy shit. No. Okay. No. <laughs> Alright, we have no idea what's about to happen, so uh, where do we want to go? Let's do the forest and then, like, try taking different second routes. Yeah, why not? That's true. Let's, yeah, let's, let's play do that. it out real quick and see what happens. Do oh, we can also sell items. Hmm. Yeah. That could be useful. Yeah, we could sell stuff we don't need. They're not worth that much. No, no. but if we need them in a pinch, that's yeah. good yeah. to know. Yeah, why don't we why don't we putz around here a little bit and see what happens? Okay, let's go north and see if that gives us a different base or black earth. Yeah. Again. Yeah. Doobie -dee -doobie -dee 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 -doop. What do we got? Heart belly! Hey, there we go. It really okay. feels like everything is just random, and yeah. it doesn't actually matter. I don't think it matters so where just... we go. Yeah, east. Go, go east? east? Yeah, why not? East. <laughs> no! Familiar more. scent. We get the same thing. So if you find something on the first one, great. We get a second one mm. if we go for familiar scent. So we need a bunch of stuff. So whenever we find holy water, we'll go for the familiar scent and grab I the second one I think the holy well. water might be like the fog. Possibly. Mm. We'll try that next. But it's good to know that going east the second time will always get always get us double. Do we want to read? Yes. Wait, what about what about uh there was a date with me you? No, it was, no. It was Oh, no. am I crazy? Yeah, it was Hikari. 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 Okay, all right. Never mind. Yeah, we'll read get I up need, the alchemy thing. We and... need to we need to get up our grades. Yeah. We can't fail this test. No, no. I got you. I got you. 
me know. Mm -hmm. It's a nice, easy, quick day. Yep. Day off. What that schedule looking like? Ooh, it's raining today, Rain. so that's good. But it doesn't affect our reading, and I think we've kind of decided clubs don't matter. Yeah. So it doesn't really mean much. Wait, wait. Let's check the schedule just in case there's a date. That's true. Hang on. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Hi. Double. Can we double whammy her? We could double whammy her. Why not? We could. If you guys are saying that affection is not a, hold up, hold up. Affection is the the love potion won't affect the gifts we give them, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's do that first date. Give her the item that we have. Okay. Which should put us up Three. very close, because then we can also spend time, which would get us to twenty percent. Yeah. This is a lovely gift, okay? How did you know I'd like such a thing? The uh, internet. internet. Guides. <laughs> Thank you, I'll treasure this. Yay. How much? Three. Three points. Spend time, 20, and then we're going on a date tonight. Nice. Nice. Pointless things to talk about. Okay. Going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. Where was she Convenience now? Convenience store. Convenience store. Ah, right, because she's Buying someone who has line. to go buy shit. Okay, go on a date. Your relationship will progress. Let's do this. Hey, Mew. Uh, would you like to grab something to eat? We should have bought something. Perhaps. We should have bought some wine. Mm. <laughs> You're not planning to take me to some greasy burger place, are you? Well, not now. <laughs> No, unless you want to go. Burgers are delicious. I can't afford to eat garbage no. like that. You can't afford it! Besides, what would everyone think if they saw me at such an establishment? My personal value would plummet. Wow. Maybe they'd be like, wow, she's a lot more relatable and a nicer person than I thought she was. Yeesh, I was actually thinking about the local cafe, unless that displeases you. No, I've been there, and their tea selection is quite nice. I'll join you, but if you need to go change first. Huh? What's wrong with these clothes? They hardly smell at all. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I mean, he's got a point That's now. Yeah. Right there. yeah. That's Nimbo energy right there. You are making a joke, aren't you? More or less. <laughs> she is obviously holding back a larger laugh. She doesn't look like it, though. Can we get that <laughs> again? <laughs> Jenny? Welcome. Oh, hi, Miss Him Himora. It's good to see you again. The usual table? Yes, please, Jenny. Why didn't we get this treatment when we all came together? Yeah. Yeah. I'll bring you some menus shortly. Please make yourself comfortable. Whoa. You're a regular here? Mm-hmm. Like I said, their tea selection is adequate, and I like to come here to study. Ah, I see. Say, Mew, what do your parents do for a living? I couldn't help but notice when I walked you home the other day that your house is quite large. And we're kind of short on money, so maybe we'll rob you. Yeah. <laughs> it's an option. I'm surprised you don't already know. The student body tends to gossip enough. I don't pay attention. Well, treat me like i am been in a coma for a while. Tell me the details, girl. <clears throat> well, there isn't much to say, really. My mother inherited our fortune from my grandfather. Mm-hmm. Oh? That's well, usually how it how goes. Well, how did he earn his money? I don't mean to pry, I'm just genuinely cur curious. Theft of labor, I'm assuming? Mm -hmm. I'm afraid I can't say. Or rather, I don't know. Hmm, I see. Mother has never told me the truth. Which means it's bad. I'm not suspicious. It's bad. Mafia. I feel like she'd be so much more interesting as a mafia princess. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like she's just generically rich. Something about the way she said that makes me feel like uh, she's lying to me, but I can't be too sure. Uh, alright. Well, let's change the subject. What do you want to do after you graduate this year? Sorry? You... you actually want to know what I want to do? 
This uh, is how it works. Yeah. Um, no, remember, the government is forcing us into all of this. <laughs> That's Not true. unless we suck at it. <laughs> no one ever asked me that. Huh. Seriously? People ask me that every day. I thought it was a normal conversation topic. Though, people think I'm pretty aimless, so maybe they're just worried about me. That's possible. Yeah. <laughs> but someone like you has the whole world in their grasp, so... What do you want to do? Can I throw out there? I don't think that it's it's we're required to become magical girls. I think we're required to learn about magical girls and magic. So it might just be like a safety thing. I think we're yeah. required to attend the academy. Yeah, yeah. what we, we do what we do afterwards might be entirely up to us though. They'll probably heavily try to recruit us for certain things if we show proficiency though. Sure, but it might just be like more about learning to control your powers. Yeah. And maybe they I might don't try to think a place that is forcing you to go to school for this is gonna let you fuck off and just work at a convenience store the rest yeah. of your life. I hear I where honestly... you're coming from, but this this feels more like a, you know, hey, learn how to not blow people up by accident kind of situation. I, I think this might even be like more like dependent on whether or not they actually go into like magical girl based jobs or like civilian jobs like i feel like someone like hikari who's got healing powers would probably be you know like she might be like you know uh persuaded to tr go for a career as like a nurse or something like that yeah they'd probably like try to give you like a career aptitude kind of thing but i don't know whether this is going to be like conscription or something oh i I've never said this out loud, but I would love to go overseas and join a famous orchestra. I play violin, you see. Of oh, course you do. That's amazing. You should totally do that. I'm torn, though. I might never get the chance to do such a thing. I have a responsibility here. What responsibility? Saving the world, you dumb fuck. There are people relying on me. Let's leave it at that. <laughs> She's afraid to leave Ray on her own. <laughs> <laughs> By people relying on you, do you mean me and Ray? No, not exactly. But also Ooh, not, not exactly. Ooh, I know, I know. You're probably the president of a school club, right? Like, the chess club or something. <sighs> I suppose it's just natural you would assume I'm a club president. Oh, she's not. Well, she's happy about that. There's that condescending tone again. Why are we like her? As a matter of fact, I am part of a club, though it's not related to school. Oh? And the members are all rather hopeless without me, to be honest. Just talking about us, I know. Can I join your club? You're already in it. It's the Dumbledore's <laughs> army. <laughs> Why? Because we're friends, right? No. <laughs> friends? Maybe. Bruh. You reject Hikari, Miyu rejects you. No. <laughs> no, I think it's more of she's never had a, a genuine friend like that before, so what she's probably Ray? like, what is... Well... Uh, I may, maybe I guess, but... I feel like I'd rather set up Miyu and Ray than oh, us and Miyu. <laughs> Hello, okay, I'm sorry I haven't messaged you until today. I've been dreadfully busy with the work. Author. I stare at the message in confusion. Who is this supposed to be from? I shoot a text back and ask who it is. Oh, Noriko! Oh, my mistake! This is Noriko. We met last weekend. I wanted to apologize for running off all of a sudden that day. Your confession of love for Cutie Star inspired me to rush home and work as hard as I could. No. Holy damn! No. Noriko Ito actually kept my phone number. Am I dreaming? Did I wake up this morning? What topsy-turvy world have I found myself in? Okay, okay, play cool, play cool. Don't scare her off. Be casual. I slowly text her back and say it's good to hear from her. Oh, good. I was afraid I might have interrupted your weekend. Anyway, I'm free tomorrow afternoon. Would you like to meet up after you finish school? Holy damn, again. 
Oh my god. Noriko Ito actually wants to meet up with me. Am I dreaming? Did I fall into a coma and this is all some made up fantasy? Have I been isekai ah. Did Truck Coon hit me? No. <laughs> I've got to keep playing it cool. If I scare her off now, I'll never forgive myself. I keep my reply short and sweet to avoid embarrassing myself. Fantastic! Well, I know where your academy is, so how about I meet you out front when the day is over? It's a date! Oh! A date! I can't believe it. Oh, uh, wow. She said the word. She said the D word. I have a date. Oh, we didn't even have to get her up to 10% perfection. <laughs> I guess well, we did, we did propose. That's 10%, right? <laughs> uh, <laughs> did I, you, uh, text her back. Be like, I'm sorry. <laughs> your your perfection level is not high enough to ask me out on a date yet. <laughs> <laughs> I have a date. An actual date with none other than the creator of Cutie Star. I need to take a deep breath and compose myself. I'll have to be on my best behavior. Be polite, not make a fool of myself. Just not be me. Tomorrow, tomorrow after school. It's too soon. I'm not ready. No, I can do this. I can handle it. So our whole harem's gonna invite themselves, aren't they? I'll yes. spend. I'll spend today prepping myself, and I should clean up the apartment. You, who knows if everything goes well? Maybe Noriko will want to come back. Wow! Oh, oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, okay, gotta hello. get, gotta get, 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 get your head in the game. Uh, Tomorrow can't come soon enough. God, I don't like okay. That was our whole day, dude. If your favorite manga author said they wanted to go out with you, That's your you'd whole be spending day. your whole day getting ready. I get up extra early this morning, getting all my things before heading to school. I could hardly sleep last night. My excitement is, is at a tipping point. If I can just get through today, then my date with Noriko will finally be here. The day passes by agonizingly slow. <laughs> the second hand on the clock ticks forward at a snail's pace. Every now and then, it seems to move back a step. Then, when the final bell of this day rings out, I rush to the school gate. She's not here. Noriko is nowhere to be found. Has she forgotten about me? Did she abandon me? Has she taken another lover? <laughs> <gasps> hey, you. Oh, there she is! Noriko Ito! Manga creator extraordinaire. She's gorgeous, radiant, stunning. There are only 10,000 words that can describe her beauty in this language. I should tell her that. Someone should do a mod for this game where it's Junji Ito instead. Yes. <laughs> hey, Noriko, did you know that there are only 10,000... Hmm? Uh, never mind. Damn it, okay. That was an inside thought. What's wrong with you? Nice save. That was a stupid thought. I didn't... Oh, wait, nah. I need to play it cool and think about every move I make. Uh, so... Now that you have me here, what would you like to do? I would like to I have didn't know. you. I didn't know. I didn't think I'd. I didn't think I'd get this far. Um, I would like to have you. Well, uh, next time. Next time. Next time. Next time. Bye bye. 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 Hey, thanks for watching, and if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell icon for notifications. If you enjoyed this video, give us a like, and feel free to check out some of our other gaming videos, our weekly podcast, Anime Yay or Nay, or our parody series, Madoka Magically Abridged. See you next time!